As a long-time Mandro user, you probably have a lot of important files stored on your device like photos, music, contacts, or text messages. Over time, you might have accidentally deleted some files you didn't want to lose. In today's Android data recovery video, I'm going to show you how to recover them quickly and easily using DBAC Android. Before we start, let me delete a couple of files first so we can recover them later in this tutorial. For demonstration purposes, I'm going to delete some photos. But keep in mind, this works not just for photos it supports all kinds of data, including videos, WhatsApp chats, and more. The tool we'll use today is DBAC Android. I'll leave the download link in the description below for you to try it out. Once you have it installed, open it and select the Recover Phone Data option. Now, connect your Android phone to your computer using a USB cable. If you're prompted to allow USB debugging, click Allow. If not, here's what you need to do. Go to the About Phone page in Settings. Tap the build number 7 times to unlock developer options. Open developer options and enable USB debugging. Once that's done, DBAC Android will begin scanning your device to retrieve the lost data. Now, select the file types you want to recover. If you're unsure about which files you need, you can leave all file types selected and click the Recover button. Here comes the exciting part as the skin progresses. You'll start seeing your deleted files appear on the screen. And we've successfully recovered the deleted photos. Now. Simply copy the files from your computer and paste them into the Photos folder on your Android device. Switch back to your phone and check it out. Boom! There they are fully recovered. One thing to note, DBAC Android is a premium tool. While there is a free preview option to see what data can be recovered, you'll need to purchase the full version to actually recover the files. This is because data recovery is a complex process, and reliable tools like this require a lot of development to ensure your data is safely retrieved. That's it for today's Android data recovery video. I hope this tutorial helps you recover your lost data with ease. If you have any questions or concerns, leave a comment below, and don't forget to check out the link in the description to download DBAC Android. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.